Sarova Taita Hills Game Lodge offers a truly exclusive bush experience, being situated in the heart of the Taita Hills Wildlife Sanctuary, a private conservancy of 28,000 acres located at the foot of the Taita Hills and adjacent to Savo West National Park, one of the world's largest game reserves. This week on Travel Diaries, we want to focus on quality time, on getting away from all the stress and appreciating your bond together as a couple. Now, more and more couples are looking for amazing getaways over the weekend to really spend quality time together and have an unforgettable weekend. Well, I found just the place at Sarova Salt Lake in Taita Hills. It's a five-hour drive from Nairobi, and when you arrive, they usually give you a chance to freshen up and enjoy lunch at the Taita Game Lodge, which is their sister lodge. As you proceed through the sanctuary towards Salt Lake, you can do a spot of game viewing on the way for a few minutes. But the main attraction is the sight of the lodge as you drive up. It's been likened to a picture out of a fairy tale, being the only hotel entirely built on stilts. Here, we spent the weekend with a Kenyan couple who wanted to spend some quality time together and see what Taita had to offer. The architectural design was inspired by the culture of the people in terms of the rooms being shaped like huts and the history of the area as the walls were built similar to bunkers from World War I and II. The entire lodge is raised on high stilts above watering holes and feeding pastures offering a spectacular view of the wildlife from above and all around. And you can walk to and from your room to the dining area in safety using the pretty wooden bridges. They offer luxury accommodation and facilities and is the perfect place in an unforgettable setting as well as the rare experience of proximity to the wildlife. Since the lodge is unfenced, animals such as gazelles and elephants are commonly sighted on the grounds and at the watering hole. You can also go to their underground tunnel to get a closer view of the game. The game drive was a special event for the couple as it was the first time they got to see an elephant in person and they certainly were in for a treat as we also spotted a lioness with three cubs playing nearby. And witnessed another lioness further up protecting her kill of a baby eland. Taita Hills Sanctuary provides a safe environment to over 50 species of mammals and 300 species of birds. And apart from the lions and elephants, we also got to see the Kongoni, gazelle, buffalo, giraffe, eland, waterbuck, ostrich and baboons. Salt Lake Game Lodge organized a very special sundowner at Kudu Point with views of the sanctuary at your feet and magnificent sights of Mount Kilimanjaro. 
and as the sun sets over the Taita Hills, the couple enjoy a toast together that will set the tone for one of the most romantic weekends ever. The Gonda traditional entertainers set the mood for romance with their serenading performance and one couldn't ask for a more perfect setting. The sundowner was followed by a lavish bush dinner at Ndovu Point. And whilst you have nothing to fear in terms of elephants gate crashing your dinner, the candlelights and bonfire set up and combined with the sounds of the wild made for a truly beautiful evening in the bush. As the sun comes up over the Taita Hills, the couple were treated to an early morning bush breakfast and nature walk, feeling bonded and relaxed from getting out of the city and being only surrounded by nature. Salt Lake Game Lodge is a great place to escape to as a couple. It's romantic, serene, picturesque, and gives you a chance to relax, unwind, and fall in love with each other all over again. Well, you have to admit that Sarova Salt Lake sums up what a perfect couple's weekend should be. It's quiet, serene, you're one with nature, and you're so important that the wildlife actually come to visit you. So this is one of those places I would highly recommend that you pay a visit. But this is just the first chapter in the book of perfect couple getaways in Kenya. Another amazing location on the way on Travel Diaries with Nick.